hey this is vikas again and uh, this time i thought to uh, give my pick also in the diff explanation so uh, already you will be having some basic idea about viscosity uh, you might be knowing like viscosity is nothing but the resistance provided between the layers of the fluid uh, like whenever fluid is flowing that resistance comes into picture and viscosity is nothing but the measurement of that uh, resistance uh suppose uh, if uh, if a fluid is suppose this is my fluid so definitely it will be having layers right so when fluid flows then uh, there is a uh, resistance provided by each layer to every uh, nearest layer right so that resistance we consider as viscosity but as you know we have two types of viscosity one is dynamic one is kinematic so what is the physical feel of dynamic viscosity and what is physical feel of kinematic viscosity that is the main issue today so i will explain very properly i'll try to explain see try to understand under what conditions fluid used to flow right so suppose you have uh, uh, any fluid which is about to flow so fluid can flow suppose this is a pipe in this pipe fluid has to flow so if there is a pressure difference between both the ends then fluid will flow if here you have more pressure here you have less pressure then fluid will flow or suppose uh, there is a table on the table you have some fluid and you just force the fluid somehow blow the air or something like makes uh, ma you just make the fl this fluid to flow right okay this is one way i mean to say just apply some external force to make this fluid drop to flow okay there is one way there is one way to make the fluid flow that is called external force and if suppose there is no external force but still the fluid wants to flow then it can be only because of the weight of the fluid suppose uh, you have something like uh, inclined plane and here you have some fluid then this fluid will flow only because of its weight right so there are two ways fluid can flow one because of external force and one because of its own weight right okay so uh, dynamic viscosity comes into picture when fluid is flowing or uh, fluid is coming to motion because of external force and kinematic viscosity comes into picture when fluid is flowing because of its own weight okay now see in both kind of motions fluid will apply resistance right so when there is a resistance in the fluid i mean uh, fluid is providing the resistance uh, when external force is applied that time we discuss dynamic viscosity and when fluid is giving you resistance uh, providing resistance when there is flow only because of weight of the fluid that time that resistance is kinematic viscosity right take an example suppose you have a honey suppose uh, you have taken uh, two jars in one jar you have taken honey and in one jar you have taken mayonnaise right suppose this is honey and this is mayonnaise so in case of honey uh, stir both take a straw and stir both so here you are when stirring the honey and uh, mayonnaise together then definitely you are applying some external force right that case definitely no doubt you will experience honey is providing more resistance right when you try to rotate the stir the honey you will feel like honey is providing more uh, uh, resistance right honey will not uh, move easily right as compared to mayonnaise but so here you are applying external force then which viscosity then which resistance uh, that resistance is nothing but uh, vis uh, dynamic viscosity right uh take the same example and pour this honey pour this jar of honey and mayonnaise then that time you will realize mayonnaise is difficult like you cannot pour mayonnaise easily like but honey you can pour easily right from the jar that time mayonnaise i mean mayonnaise will come down or honey will come down not because you are stirring it, they will come down because of their own weight so here second second time we are discussing the motion of honey or mayonnaise because of their own weights right so that time kinematic viscosity so when so now come come again when we are uh, uh, when we are stirring the honey and mayonnaise that time we are applying external force so dynamic viscosity is coming into picture that time resistance of uh, honey i mean resistance provided with the honey is more but when we are pouring them i mean when we are pouring both the jars then that time mayonnaise is providing more resistance it is not being poured properly right but honey is that time honey is comfortable honey is pouring being poured right so that time kinematic viscosity uh, we can compare so dynamic viscosity of honey is more but kinematic viscosity of this guy i mean uh, mayonnaise is more right if you don't know what is called mayonnaise uh, then google it like we that 
cream the kind of cream we use over like uh, pizza burger and uh, those things right fine uh, okay and uh, honey is newtonian fluid and mayonnaise is non newtonian fluid okay uh, you can check out other videos how to discuss i mean the physical feel of those things fine i hope you got the physical feel of uh, dynamic viscosity and kinematic viscosity thank you so much